better, you better. Oh my goodness! Hit him! <laughs> oh, no. oh. You are now listening to On Tap with the Boys, a podcast about beer, bad decisions, and bad friends, with your hosts Cody, Tyler, Dalton, and Tucker. Okay. Pause. Okay. All right, here we are. Episode, this is, is this episode three? Uh, Two, three. It is three. Give me freaking shit. Let's go. Off. Check this out. We got shirts, hats, three. coolers, everything. On top with boys.com. Order from there. That supplies the beer from now on. Where? What does? Word up. Uh, okay, if you can't already tell, um, <laughs> uh, Cody has been pretty busy earlier today because now he is unemployed. So, yeah. <laughs> so what he does now is he drinks before the podcast and he holds us up. So now he is. Uh, what are you? What are you, what He's are you on, on right a now? whole okay. nother level? What Picture level this. Know? Picture this. Boy quits his job. No, you got fired, dude. You don't have to lie down. <laughs> Boy gets fired. Boy starts drinking every day at three p.m. Yes. Boy does podcast. At 9 p.m., you do the math. Boy meets world? Yep. <laughs> okay, let's go. Exactly. There we go. Well, Heard I mean, that. the the thing is, you don't really need a job when your dad pays for everything anyway, so. That is a good point. Yeah. That is so, a good point. So, yeah, shout out to Chad for funding the whole merch drop <laughs> and everything. That was Appreciate huge. that. I was going to say, when did boy have time to ask for dad's money? <laughs> <laughs> What um did you guys see the post on Facebook? Uh so everybody thanks for the the awesome support for the um shirts and whatnot. Somebody said to make a shirt yeah, of oh, this. This one, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And I was screwing with Cody asking if we'd we'd have to get a dad to fund I agree. It. Yeah, I, I think it'd that. be pretty cool. I was idea. actually thinking that a shirt with all four of us would be the way to go, but I was thinking there was gonna be discrepancies. Because it's uh, wider than it is yeah. taller. Mm-hmm. It's going to be a small. Just like me, wider than I am tall. <laughs> yeah. Maybe that's a good sleeve thing, <laughs> oh, actually. Dude. A little logo on the sleeve. Sure. That's actually, like that. I'd, That'd be kind of cool. I like just, that idea. Just the characters. Yeah. That might, well, it's going to be a lot of detail. Our shirt guy is having issues with We can take out some of the detail. Who cares? We just gonna do, hey, we I was can just get, you can stack them. You could do, you could do. No, no. I think we just get a different shirt guy. <laughs> yeah, fucking get rid of me. <laughs> oh shoot. Godspeed. That is a good point. I would like <laughs> I would like I would like to point out that today I did not drink for no reason during the day before the podcast because I did actually sell five coolers before we came or before I came here. Nice. Really? Five? At the golf course. At the golf course. Yep. You sold five coolers. Yep. Then. I brought one there. In with empty cardboard, bought yeah. beers at the thing. It and everybody saw me up. put it on the bar. They're like, what is that? What is that? And I'm just like, oh, listen. Let me tell you a story. Boys.com is the only place you can get this exact cooler. That is the only First place. First off. Second off, this will keep your freaking beer cold for the whole seven golf hours. Journey. No ice. Listen, no ice. put those stupid black coolers and that go I, I, okay, on the carts okay. away. Dude, get Yeti, get Yeti is shaking in their boots. Okay. I will personally guarantee five hours of a cold beer because I've freaking done it with a hot ass sun on it, and mm-hmm. it, it's crazy. It, yeah, you yeah. wouldn't expect it. As long you as you put your sun it? on it, well, he was doing nothing else. I told him to warm up the beers for me. <laughs> warm up the beers for me. Yeah, Tyler doesn't have a sun. No, he doesn't. He's not no more. The court took him. <laughs> took him. <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna have a few step he's, sons later. Yeah, he's oh, he's yeah. gonna be all breader now. He, I was gonna say he's in a breader parade. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, this this is officially your stepmom's favorite podcast. So it I'm is. Like, you yeah, might be. My, is. You, you like that? I put some of the the posts that I shared on Facebook. It said, "Get your stepmom something nice." <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I like that. I do really enjoy Get your that. Dude, yeah. Whoever came up with that, is my really mom, my cool. mom. Because she messaged on the website, yeah, yeah, asking about like, oh, did you get my message? I was like, I don't, I don't see him. But uh, she was wondering what that was all about. She the stepmom like, thing. Yeah, she's like, what? What's this like stepmom? Like, did you what? have to tell I, her what porn is? No, did I. Did you explain the dynamic of Pornhub? I didn't know that that's where we got this. Oh, that's kind of what I was. Well, like, yeah, the vibe yeah. Going, like I was what going are you with doing more or less step like bro, like yeah, that kind yeah, of. Yeah, that's where I was going with it. My whole yeah. life revolved around porn. What would you? So. What, would you, I what did told, you think it was? I, I just thought it was a little bit of an edgy thing. It was funny. <laughs> well, yeah, but it's like kind of like because of porn. Mom porn. It's thing. edgy because yeah. of porn. That's what it is to me. 
at least. Uh, well, it's open see, to and interpretation. And see, I didn't get that when I first heard, saw Neither it. Neither did I. I just yeah, thought it like, sounded funny. That's I thought it sounded that's funny also. unhappy relationships. <laughs> 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 Let's go. Oh. Happy birthday again, Taylor. Spicy. We are five minutes into recording and I'm single. <laughs> Just kidding. Now we, we shout her out a lot. She's a yeah. great gal. Now we can spend that No merch money. discrepancy. Beer and hookers. Yeah, right. We're going to <laughs> Vegas this weekend. This Matt, no. I'm working. Yesterday, why? This weekend? No. Yeah, let's You're go not right working. now. I'm in. What do you Are mean we go to Sunday? Vegas this weekend? It's Friday night. <laughs> yeah. We still got I two days I, ahead of us. I really, I can't wait until uh, layoff because I would really like to do something like this one time. Yes. I'm in. Just, hey, do you want to hop on a plane right now go to Vegas? Yeah. Hell yeah. Yep. <laughs> I'm Truck broke guy. as I, shit. I have so much money saved up uh, in... Airlines gift cards and my credit card. I was gonna say humble break. Airlines reports. Dude, I'm rich rewards. as fuck. I need to go gamble. <laughs> you should say. I don't want to gamble. Your dad's I rich as fuck. <laughs> I can go gamble. Like, my dad put my dad put my mortgage on his credit card for me and got points. My what, I my dad my has so card. many miles on his credit card. <laughs> my dad could beat up your dad. <laughs> he could definitely beat up mine. <laughs> <laughs> you can beat my ass, but my dad will sue. <laughs> okay, college he, kid home from I, for the weekend. Dude, whatever, or whatever, freaking overly I excited thought, sports I fan. Thought, honestly, thought you said you can eat my ass. <laughs> <laughs> you can also do that <laughs> for the low, low price of three ninety nine. Mm. That, I that hope discount? you're tasty. Speaking of discounts, I hope you're tasty. I hope you're hungry. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of, speaking of discounts, uh, oh, dude! Oh no, I broke my what mind. What kind of discounts are we? Ta- are we gonna talk about discounts at all? Maybe or just wait? No, that's a while out. I gotta fix my microphone. Yeah, that's yeah. a while out. Continue while without out. me. Never mind. No, never mind. Yeah, there's discounts. There's discounts. Um, spend on over ass. on the on tap with the boys website. You spread spread. <laughs> you spread breaded money. <laughs> <laughs> you. Spend over one hundred and twenty dollars on any merchandise. It does not matter what the hell you so buy. Buy yourself, and you a get a ton free of T-shirt using the code Freebie. That's the thing. F R E E B E E. F R E E. That spells free. Yes. <laughs> so <laughs> keep, in mind, uh, keep in mind, you do have once you get two hundred twenty dollars in the shopping cart. It's set up so if you add a T-shirt, it'll automatically bring it to zero. But you have to add the T-shirt to the cart. Because some people, I have also yes. set up, you buy two t-shirts, you get two stickers free. You some people to. were buying two t-shirts, not adding two stickers to the cart, so they didn't get the two free stickers. But I think that you should be nice, is what I said, but Cody said, Yeah, no, I'm putting it in there. I'm putting the it. stickers in there still, <laughs> but just so everybody knows, that's how you get the promo. Yeah. You don't pay tax but on the promo. Here's also the shitty part, is that we're going to be two weeks, two, no, one week into the website being live, and now you're telling them that this code is on there. Because last episode, you Why said- is it shitty? Dude, everybody. If you want, we got six other designs. If you, I know, I know. Eight, we got eight. But they could have done the seven fr- other whatever. designs. Fuck it, it's not that shitty. If you wanted, if I'm you bad. want the deal, you get the other. Order again. Who cares? You know, you're gonna buy more anyways. Might as well buy it now. <laughs> right? Yeah. Who cares? I hear you. Right? Who cares? We got some big things in the works right now. A couple. Why'd you do that? That was a fastball. You 90, 90, 95 you? miles an hour. That was kind of a girly ball. left-handed you, throw. You literally did the same <laughs> shit that earlier. Yeah, but that was like aggressive and weird kind of. <laughs> oh, my God. That was like a go? really big weird We dude. got a, a couple of big <laughs> things in the works, a couple different videos. If you haven't seen the bar character selection video on our YouTube channel, go check that out it's right going now. great. What, 5,000 views? Danny's not in it for you know no. copyright reasons, but. Dude, you know what would be really cool? What? If you just like got out of frame and we just put Danny there, that'd be way cooler than you. <laughs> I'll just disappear. I'll put the mic under the desk. I'll record everything like this and you put Danny in front of my spot. All right, dude, this is, I already am really liking where this is going. Cody Science just- is badass. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the first person to order. One of the first people uh, to order was our high school science teacher. Yes. Shout out. Mr. Adams, you're the man. Science is badass. Dude. dude, Cody got a lot better looking. Yeah, dude. I'm four foot ten now. <laughs> In your pants. Look at my. W- oh, 
You've ruined it. <laughs> oh, did I? Oh, did I ruin? The, oh shit! I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's how original your joke was, Danny. <laughs> yeah, fuck you, Danny. Our, yeah, so fuck our science me. teacher fuck was me, the Danny. first one ever. To <laughs> wow. Hey, just so we all remember, my grandma watches these. <laughs> We can cut that out. What is going on? <laughs> we okay. can bleep all that. No, oh no, God. we're not bleeping anything because we're uncensored now. We're um, off the grid. It's 9 right. p.m. at night, and we're, we record on Fridays. You got to give us a break. This is what you happens know? when they Cody, expect this. This is what happens when Cody drinks before the podcast. They expect this. This is what they're here for. Let's put a real, little structure into this, okay? I'm, d I'm done with all this bullshit. Okay. Okay, let's put some structure into this. Have you or have you guys not heard of the testacuzzi? I have seen that. No, yes. I don't think I have. Yeah. The testacuzzi? No. Yeah. Okay. So I already know what I'm... It's okay. literally okay. a little jacuzzi <laughs> that you rest your balls in. And it, it aerates and like... Airy, it areolas yeah. your No, balls. it's like a little hot tub, like bubbles and everything. Aerates, you mean? Okay. Yeah, aerates yeah. your balls and it's got a little pad for your... your Ween? What, 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 <laughs> the pod, dude. Yeah, the pod. Obviously shaft. the pod. Winkus. You put your pod on this little pad and your... <laughs> the, the pod pad. The pod freaking pad. Freaking balls. <laughs> your balls are sitting in this. Why do we not have this on the you website? Know, you know what I... <laughs> dude. Okay, so I went on their website. First of all, their original price is supposedly $100. $100 what? And they're on, the sale, they're on sale for $70. Wish.com says is $49. Too 99. Much. <sighs> That's actually a lot for Wish. I thought it was going to be like five bucks. But they had a gold, a 24 karat gold plated one that they probably made like four of them and they sold out. But could you imagine having a 24 karat gold plated testacuzzi on your like bathroom vanity? So what's the <laughs> point of this testacuzzi? I don't know. What do they claim? Okay. Yeah. So is this like um, a it's gotta be health novelty. benefit of some it sort? It was on the doctor show or whatever. Honestly, I didn't do a whole lot of research. Dr. Oz? No. No, the doctors. I think it's literally called the doctors. Yeah. yeah. The doctors. That's the stupidest thing I ever heard. This is why I don't have regular uh, TV anymore. No, what the, the hell? The doctor. It's on what the hell? Oh, okay. No. What? As seen wow. on the doctor's TV show. Okay, never mind. Yeah, yeah the doctor's. So freaking stupid. But, dude, I just, what I thought initially, I don't know if this is screwed up, but dude, what if instead of putting water in this thing, soy sauce, bro? <laughs> <laughs> You're going to get Kyle all right. Get that flavor up, up in there. Oh and just God. really. Really seals in the flavor. <laughs> yeah, know? I'm trying to God, see. What, I'm trying be... to see what they claim, but here's their here's their uh, description. Uh, what, Forty bucks. Yeah. The, the, what the testacuzzi is oh, the perfect gift off. for the man that cares about his testicles. Now here's a play on words. Happiness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's her thing. How did that, you find one for forty? I'm on their website. And this it says is on their website. Sixty nine. Oh no, it's on. This is why I'm broke. Oh, sixty nine, sixty nine is pretty funny. <laughs> uh, it says the it. testacuzzi features an ultra soft precast silicone pillow to rest your largest member on, a deep reservoir to dunk the junk into, and battery powered bubbles. I don't know if I go with largest member. I think the balls are bigger than the shaft. Is this a clean no, thing? Or what is Wait a kidding. minute, Tyler. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Is Send me your number and you'll find out. It, so what's, oh, what, what's their no, lane? No, no, no. Where are they trying to apply this? This is a cleaning thing. Or uh, what? You I know, think it's more of a pleasure thing. Like, I don't know. No, I, I'm going to come out. I'm going to come. Have you ever taken a shower head on your balls, dude? No, no, what? no. It feels, it feels yeah. good, dude. Try it Stop. out. Stop. Try it out. This is on you, tap with the boys. You shower in yeah, a this is boy talk, dude. You got a handicap shower? Mine doesn't even detach <laughs> from the wall. I was going to say, well, what I know it is because he's that tall. His balls are hanging <laughs> from the, the shower. What I do head. is I grab my handicap railing, and I stand up from my wheelchair. And I, grab the, <laughs> I grab the shower head, and it's like. And he goes dude, to the try, You guys don't have removable shower heads? No. Dude, what are you, are you in 2004? What are you doing? What is going on? You're just getting up and walking out. I was out. about to leave. Stupid. Because you always make fun of minorities, whether it's handicapped or, <laughs> or, or LGBT. Or LGBT. <laughs> they, uh, they, they, don't, they don't really ever say what. what it's I for. think it's more. It's a gag. It's, it's, it's a, a gag. Uh, right. Whatever you want it to be. It yeah, can be serious or it can be fun. Just buy it. I, my, guess is, my guess is they had it on the doctors talking about whether or not it was safe. They're probably a much gag. Well, it's just like sitting in a place. hot tub. I mean, you're, you're. Yeah, and from what I gather, the like boys are in there anyway. I don't put my nuts in hot tubs. <laughs> yeah, I actually, that is yeah, true. I do out. see you. Keep hang it out. Them over your shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. and sit down. 
He's actually got like. I don't want to get my hair wet. Just, just, just like your grandma used to do with her shoes on the way to church. She puts he puts a bread bag over it when he goes. Into the, the, <laughs> it says wonder on the side of it, you know, with Yikes. the freaking wonder bread. Yeah, but it's his penis. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but it's his penis. Okay. I, I'm a We're getting a little off I'm the rails No, here. this is this is the rails. I have testacuzzi on the freaking rails, dude. Did you know? <laughs> did you know that bottles of beer were made in 1850, but cans didn't show up till 1935? <laughs> <laughs> I did not know that. I I will be straight up honest with you. I didn't know that. Yeah, yeah. That's a, I didn't I know it either. That's why I, I did yeah. know that bottles were before cans, but I didn't know the time. Dude, I right. literally i I thought this whole time. That cans didn't come around until 1936. So yeah, thank yeah, God yeah. you told me that. Now, now you can you have to go back and correct everyone you told. Yeah, I know. Dude. Like That's all literally one of them. my opener. That's why I keep losing bar trivia, dude. Yeah, exactly. Fuck. Fool. Is that the only one? No, I got, I got like thing? five more. You want to hear more? Uh, Are these just facts? Facts about beer, yes. Okay. You want to hear? Uh, <laughs> did you know that the Puritans brought more beer than they did water? Oh, <laughs> hold the Pinkertons? No, the Puritans. Oh, oh damn, Pinkertons. <laughs> Pinkertons. <laughs> damn Pinkertons. Is this an inside joke or is everybody in the world play uh, Red Dead Redemption? <laughs> I've never played it. Really? Never Wait, do played it. Do you know it. the Pinkertons all? Nope, just for I you just guys. They're real. Did you know that? That's like a real thing. Nah, they started really. in Canada. I'd assume like everything on there is, is real. I might also. be wrong. They started, yeah, all video like, games are real. No, I mean, Red Dead actually has a pretty decent amount of history, I think. Of fake all. stuff? Yeah, they, get, they got that guy from. They the got horses. The Mormon. That's a real thing. The Mormon fucker in there. What the hell is it? Yeah. Oh. Uh, hey, don't don't put your head oh, like that. We're just controversial. Young, <laughs> young Sailor uh, Jerry. Hey, Britain, uh, Brigham Young. 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 Brigham is that liquor? Jack Daniels. Yeah. No, Sailor Jerry's is the liquor. Oh. Sailor Jerry. You're a liquor. Is your uncle is from uh, uh, Canada. Guy that I met at the marina in what's notification on your phone? Uh for YouTube. Okay. Cool. Glad that's more important. <sighs> Actually, I got I got to take this. I got a fun one for you. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that's probably very bad for the listeners. No. They don't care. It wasn't that. It wasn't that bad in my ears. They don't listen anyway. They said they don't mind it. Yeah, he asked. Freaking hand that thing to me. Give me that thing. Oh my god! You got it. More freaking facts. This is (laughs) is take it, pussy. (laughs) Take it, pussy. What is this? He's trying to give me some other air horn. Oh! Oh, You grabbed it. You didn't even take it. (laughs) You just got iced. That was crazy. <laughs> I wish I had a bottle opener to open this thing, but they're all in my car. <laughs> Why don't you keep one of them fangs on you? He won't do it. There's no, no way. He actually won't do it. No. 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 He won't do it. So you can't chug with them little oh, baby oh, bird what the, lips. What, the what was that? that? I'm very confused right now. What was that? Oh, oh no! Oh no! <laughs> what just happened? No way! <laughs> Don't get it on the board, dude. <laughs> Stop! If you're not gonna be able to finish it, stop. <laughs> I'd rather have you be a bitch than not than puke all over. Oh, I'm, you better, you better! Oh my goodness! Hit him. Oh, no. <laughs> it's one of those days. Grab the bottle. <laughs> it almost went into the bottle. Oh my god, that is that's bravery. That was you rallied, buddy. You Not like, all heroes wear capes. You, you, Seven a.m. Some, some of them wear on tap with the boys shirts. <laughs> and on tap with the boys hats. I gotta I gotta be at my dad's at seven a.m. to go down to friggin' Lakeville or something. Good luck with that. Yeah, you don't have to drive. It's not like you're shooting guns or nothing. You'll be fine. <laughs> my, my last one. My last one is that uh, there was a British. I actually missed the one was, before that. I think I was doing something. Stupid. Ah, fuck them. There was a British survey oh. for uh, in Britain Shoot. for British people. Uh, more men knew the price of their beer than they did their woman's bra size. Well, yeah. that's fair. That's fair because that is something you're directly in 
involved with every single day potentially. Oh yeah, you, you don't you don't you need said white, to know you said your wife's, girlfriend's bra no, size. No, you said wife's bra size. Could you right now? Could right. you say Abby's bra size? That's a good point. I'm I no. I could get close. How much is a bush light at at the cricket? Sixteen something on what? What? Uh, no, what? One, what? One, uh, one two dollars on Wednesdays. <laughs> Two dollars oh, on sorry. Wednesdays. You <laughs> know that. Uh, no, I, I, I was talking about a case. I thought uh, you were saying sixteen dollars for a beer. No, 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 no yeah, but yeah, you yeah. are close. But how much for one uh, beer? It is. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, it's three fifty. Three fifty is awesome. Two dollars on Wednesdays. Two dollar bush light pounders at the cricket. Get them while they're hot. It is incredible. On get Wednesdays. Wednesdays. Cold. Wednesdays. On Wednesdays. 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 That's a Wednesdays. pounder. Get in, pounder. Kids get in for free for free. I'm not, when I was at that uh, that barbecue place, getting hit on by that really fat hot chick. Yeah. Um, I went into the bathroom there to go to the. And there was a sign on the wall, NASCAR, uh, NASCAR Thursdays or something. Come here for NASCAR events on Thursdays. Bushlight Pounders, $3. I'm like, <laughs> how do you, uh, you never heard of the Cricket Barn, girl? <laughs> the uh, Cricket Barn piece of them? Yeah. And fair food. <laughs> Everybody go on Google right now and suggest the Google listing to be changed from the Cricket to the cricket bar and pizza. Oven. Well, here's the problem. It's the cricket bar for one. Yeah, cricket bar. No, and pizza on oven. Google, it's just the cricket bar and pizza. Yeah. Oven. Yep. <laughs> now we need to change it even longer. It's not the cricket bar pizza oven fair food. It's a cricket bar pizza oven fair food and ski ball. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they moved the ski ball. I they don't know if it's still there. Ball. It is still there. I was just there today. Oh, they still got the ski ball. They it's got sweet. they got a freaking ski ball fair game at the cricket. Like, like the whole like all awesome. eight lanes. Literally name it's a awesome. better bar. I, that's the hookup. Man. That's that's it. That's that it. is. Pinnacle. We should go play some skee ball. I'm yeah, in. I'm in. I'm game. I'm in. I'm game if they're open. Uh, yeah, they're probably only open until ten. And maybe maybe we'll get lucky and uh, and uh, John will be there still and he's got the key. Johnny, John, 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 John boy, John, 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 um, oh, John yeah. John. The guy John. that was hosting it, I don't know if it's the same Carney that runs it every day, but um, did say that clothing was optional to play. That's actually Dalton's real dad. What? <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Bro, you need that X Factor music, dude. It I took me a that. second to find the right camera to look at, so that might look a little funny. That's more appropriate. Not again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shucks. Peter. Hey, Peter. Is that more important than what we got going on here? Yeah, dude. I want the, this one to I make want sure. The, okay. I want this. All right, cool. I want this. Oh, God. This is intense. Is this whole thing? We're going to get five demonetized. minutes long. We're going to get demonetized again. It's not a song, it's a theme. Okay. Stop it. <laughs> I can 100% guarantee you that that is copyrighted. Okay, cut it out. Cut it out. Just put a bleep noise. Don't cut Not it out. Not for the whole thing. <laughs> Don't cut it out. Don't cut it out. It's it. fine because what would we... I mean, we're, we're not we a just thousand lost subscribers out on like, yet. We just lost out on like 10 cents. I was going to say, yeah, what would we make anyways? Who cares? Dude, I bet you... Okay, so should we be real with the listeners here? No. Yeah? Okay. No. So, no. 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 We're not doing that. Never. Yes. Yeah, we, I think we, we should. You guys. I think we yep. should. We got a garbage now outside that they pick up like really? every, every Thursday. <laughs> so we don't have a heaping pile of beer cans? <laughs> yeah, I what? came. Why did you? Dude, we got we to gotta be real. <laughs> <laughs> I came to the realization we ca we have way too much freaking trash here every week when we record yeah, this. And most of the trash I is sitting at the end of the desk. <laughs> 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 He's just laughing, not knowing what you're talking about. <laughs> He's nice. talking about me. <laughs> uh, yeah, we never did the intro. I just realized that. <laughs> Jake will put it in there roll somewhere. It. No, roll it. Roll it. <laughs> Happy birthday, Jake. You are now listening to On Tap with the Boys, a podcast about beer, bad decisions, and bad friends with your hosts, Cody, Tyler, Dalton, and Tucker. Okay, uh, I said something about it, but you guys glanced over it. Jake, he actually just told us that we could go over to his. He's having a little bond. I already talked house. to him because I'm a better friend than you. Okay. Well, what I don't like, I, I <laughs> message him at right at midnight. Well, he hey, said happy do, birthday. Do you have his address? Yeah, I've been there. Fuck. 
Welcome back to episode three. <laughs> it's Jake's birthday today. We have no producer or camera not, guy. Not a well, good, we don't not have a good camera either. guy. <laughs> He's lost in the sauce, dude. Yeah. <laughs> well, I don't know. Has he been drinking? No, nope. I doubt it. I would drinking? be very surprised if he so hasn't had a drink. Jake's twenty first today. No, and not Jake. I was saying <laughs> our producer's lost in the sauce. Oh, oh, yeah. dude. But no, what I don't understand is he is like sharp as a marble right now. I mean, his eyes are not freaking bloodshot. I mean, he's he doesn't look hammered. Listen, who? It's him? called yeah, one. Jake. It's called no, one. Cody. It's called oh. one. Good genetics. Two. Not being a bitch. Lose. Your job, <laughs> and, and then get seasoned. Okay, I'm I mean, like a, I'm like you guys a fine. Not agree with me? I mean, like oh yeah, yeah. Usually, I'm like a fine kettle. You're like a fine what? wine, seasoned. Can I get a taste? Oh, I was thinking like a cast iron skillet. You're yeah, more like you, a skillet to me. Yeah, you're more of a skillet. I have dude. zero inhibitions. You want me to slam this over my head? No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I'm know just you I will not do it. I wouldn't. We do that. know how hard it is to break a bottle. Over I know. Head. If I knew I could break it, I would. Yeah. I don't think I could break that. Just okay. Actually, all right. Welcome back to episode three. It's time for a bathroom break. It's time for a bathroom <laughs> break. The boys will be right Whatever. back. Fuck them. What? You're a fucking madman, Tucker. Walk us what? through what you just did. What? What did you just do? I just ate a jalapeno. Oh, okay, my. it's driving me absolutely God, mad that you're Driving me mad. You're getting twisted. You're not even drinking twisted tea. We're back on the bathroom um, break. Oh, grab God. These, yeah. He's drinking the hey. jalapeno. Oh, sorry. You Get yourself your some. Card. You uncultured swine. 320 koozies, boys. Come on. They're coasters, buddy. Yeah, coasters. That's what I meant. They, I uh, one. they gave us these and we're I not even using more. them. How do we. Nick. Nick, if you're watching the, this episode, how the hell do the boys get. Um, Get uh, their own brew at the 320. I think that would be the next step. Uh, well, the thing is that Dalton would not drink it because I would drink it. If it, had, if it had our name on it, I will. I will drink. I regardless I if you like know, it or not, you have to. Almost. I personally know that like light beers and and shit like that are just so uneconomical. They do. They can't do it. No, that's fine. it doesn't make sense to. Well, they're pert near. They're pert near beer. Yeah, that's. Light I can enough. drink that. I like yeah. that. Yeah, that's just because we're in Pine City and nobody really drinks. Dirt, what would we so. call it? The boys barley or something like that. Ooh, that's actually you just that. That was really quick. Was like, <laughs> off the dome, man. You got anything else? I kind of like that. Head? Maybe to make us successful, or, or oh, the boys man. brew. You know, I mean, that was stupid. Yeah. Or uh, whatever, dude. <laughs> Kitty. <Yeah. laughs> on tap with the boys podcast, Pilsner. <laughs> <laughs> that I really know. rolls off. On tap yeah. with the boys podcast. That's down the street from us and still in Pine City Ale. <laughs> yeah, it's not bad. It's IPA. got a ring to it, kind of. Belgian yeah. IPA. Okay, yeah. That, Quit chewing that. on the mic. Stop. The, no. Stop. La, 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 la. All right, he's fired. Welcome back to On Tap with the Boys ASMR. I think we literally do an we, ASMR we actually, every episode. We, we actually talked. Uh, you're you can't come to work drunk. You can get drunk at work. So yeah, you're you're you're, you're fired from yeah, here too. It's grounds for <laughs> termination. <laughs> Oh, your, once you come to the office drill. and bring your pickles, bring yep. your pickles. Yeah. <laughs> Turn in your pickles, your hat, and your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> You're done. You're fucked, buddy. And give us the passwords to the social media accounts. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. Did you? I didn't do you shit. Bastard. No, I did not. You put a hole in Danny. Oh, yes. no, I didn't. Yes, you did. No, look at yes, behind you there. Did. Look at there. <laughs> ah! Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> that was Woo! good, Cody. Oh my. It's the season of the iced. <laughs> the Venturi effect. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck it, the producer's doing it. Dude, I just swept up the other glass. I'm Why would you do that? I can do it again. <laughs> I don't care. I'm not going to be the dad of this podcast. <laughs> well, actually, you are. No, I'm not. Did we ever Quit really chewing on the mic. <laughs> <laughs> Did we? <laughs> I think we've talked about this before. Uh, Tucker's biggest pet peeve is talking with food in your mouth. Well, or chewing in general. Yeah, yeah, he's got that. Or uh, even looking at me or breathing. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> oh, <laughs> that you're having your mic. 
my heart. Because <laughs> that hurt on an emotional oh, level. Man. How? Okay. I want to apologize to the listeners. Yes. I might have blown up there a little bit. <laughs> yeah, that was but, genuine. That was not. Uh, <laughs> well, uh, for people that don't know, we never released that one clip of you telling us. Tucker's having twins. He's having kids. Not a big deal. Whatever. Um, <laughs> Blow by it. Yeah. It's just, Indigo's drinking for three now. This is a talk over. <laughs> yeah, we're just going to. We'll throw that. At, we'll throw the actual in the. In the twins. Chris episode. said the door's locked. I didn't lock it. Oh my god. I'll get it. Tell him to open it. Fucking Peter did it again. Chris. Well now Chris has got to come on the episode. Mm-hmm. Um, Chris is coming on. Tyler, one second. Did- we're gonna have a guest. Okay. Should we just wait or no? Guess on the podcast. No, we'll bring him on. We're pausing. Yeah. One second. We'll be right one back. Second. Be back. And we're back. <laughs> okay. We had this break because now we have. Big Dick Chris in the building. <laughs> What's going on, Chris? Uh, that's what they call him. On that was the his, that was his high school nickname. Check your check your mic. Explain. Let's make sure that works. Nobody calls it. It works. <laughs> Explain. <laughs> Who called you that in high school? Nobody. Just I Tyler. think it was our, yeah, our gym teacher. Not. Our gym. <laughs> well, we were, our we gym were, teacher <laughs> with the speaker box and the fanny pack. Don't say fun. the name. <laughs> we were actually talking. I about, was avoiding. <laughs> <laughs> I was avoiding the name. Well, but Chris brought it up. We were actually talking about the teacher that said it earlier. The guy that bought the shirt. No, 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 <laughs> stop, no, no, no. Stop. Stop, stop it. Science no, is no, badass, no, right? Stop. <laughs> Science no, is I, badass, but not incriminating. No, that's actually true. Well. Actually, science is incriminating if you're trying to kill somebody. That's yeah, how forensics okay. work. But, you know, it, it is what it is. I guess deal with it. So, Chris is our guest here for the day. Sort yeah. of impromptu. He did not plan on coming on the show. Nope. Chris, explain we to us. We actually wanted his daughter, but I guess she was sleeping. So, we got Chris. Yeah, explain to really us cool. for just My a couple seconds. I know. I know. <laughs> Walk us through the thrill and the exhilarating day of your life. Were you saying International Harvester in the talent show in high school? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. In front of the whole school. Does that was beautiful. beautiful. Walk us through it, start to finish, your emotions. What are we breaking out? You break the, the chair energy. again? The energy. <laughs> like, in true Plogic form, he just broke the chair that we haven't seen. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, if you don't know, this is Tyler's brother. Pull the mic closer to your yeah. face a little it's, bit so we can hear you. Yeah, make sure you can hear yourself, like... You'll get used to it. Okay. Ooh, I'm spraying. So walk That's us through this. You're you're walking out. What were you thinking as you're walking to the microphone in the middle of the gym? I was thinking I was stupid. Well, he was getting <laughs> all the time a mop. That was absolutely Yeah, terrible. because of the snail trails. The I'll tell you what. The I'll tell you what. If you, if you didn't have a girlfriend at the time... What is you got a pheasant down that? there? Right? Yeah, what was that? You're oh, smuggling a freaking, turkey. Yeah. <laughs> a chicken... I think you guys need a new chair. You got well. <laughs> I listen, just too. Hey, ask. We'll talk ask to management. Who, better question: Who broke that chair? Ask that question. Was that you? No, it's Dalton. Yeah, oh, my light ass did it. <laughs> no, I broke it, and then I bu- but I bought a new one. There's actually a brand new one upstairs, but I don't want to break that one. I ain't touching that it one. That one is nice. It's really nice. You should have broke mine. <laughs> she, she had no idea. Oh no! When, when, she did, like, you, when, you, when, you, when did you bring it into the office? When he last brought week? the other chair in. So she's been here and she has she had no clue. She oh, just yeah. sat on it and had no clue. Last week I brought it. Yeah. Oh. That's maybe she thought maybe she thought it was mine. I thought she was so pissed at me that or I brought the last notice. one and didn't replace it quicker. It's she's very similar. She actually had yeah. one of them blue chairs behind the desk, and I was like, oh yeah. no. That's why I'm like, okay. I better buy one. Like I'm like, oh, that looks kind of junky. No, she didn't even really care to be honest with you. Okay. She literally never brought it up, and she's like, whatever. I guess she told me on Xbox she was really upset. Yeah. Yeah, she hates you now. Said something about not letting you in here from now on. Yeah. But Chris, walk us through the <laughs> International Harvester, please. I it was. I don't think it's all that exciting. It was very ballsy. <laughs> in it, in, it, it in was over in too much detail, oh. tell us your whole experience from walking up to the mic, from walking back to the locker room. Go. In, in excruciating detail. Yes. Please, uh, well, I'm dying to know. This, Actually, that's exhilarating because that's tough. Dude, I never it, did the talent is, that's show. That's what I was going to say. In high school. None of us had balls. No. None Our high school was that. very you, judgmental. You, Were you in overalls? You mean you guys? Yeah. Yes, I was. And a straw hat? That's dirty. <laughs> was it no, a, you had a straw hat no, on? No, or 10 gallon? That's gang shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's gang shit. That's, that's, on, that's on gang. Dude, fake bro. farmers wear straw hats. Was it a straw hat? farmers wear mullets. You were wearing a hat of some sort, weren't you? It might have been that tan one, the really tall one. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> yeah, you guys say you didn't have the balls to do it. You guys are smarter than I was. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. Because that is that is a memory. That is a wonderful memory that yeah. you will always have. And that's 
That's what it's Honestly, all about. Honestly, that's what, mostly what I know I you by. I wish I did. <laughs> what was going through your head as you're walking you up to the stand, to though? Just all regret. Were you, were you well, nervous? I thought it was really funny. Scared? I thought it was really funny how it went because he was supposed to sing Inter- International Harvester, and they like put it on the back. Like, he's singing International Harvester, but then he's like, hey, no, no, I need the words. So it was, no, it's Christopher Ploschik singing, uh, no, Doing karaoke to international <laughs> art. Oh, no. so it, it was a talent contest of him doing karaoke. <laughs> <laughs> so you did have the words. That was going to be my next yeah, question. So for song, those who I didn't, didn't know that, for those who don't know, obviously this is Chris's br- or uh, Tyler's brother. <laughs> this is Chris's brother. This is this is the better Plajic. Yes, the better Plajic. The better Plajic. <laughs> Yeah, he actually is. I ended up good for myself, and he somehow found a way to make me look like shit. <laughs> <laughs> the golden child. That well, is a name he completely came up with. Yeah, and it's stuck. No. My parents love it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about how one year Tyler got a pair of socks for Christmas and Chris got an Xbox. <laughs> Unrelated. He actually gave me a shovel and told me to dig me myself a grave. Oh, no, boy. <laughs> in the frozen ground? Yeah. All right, yeah. cool. So see you in spring. Christmas in yeah, Florida. Right. That's when you decided yeah. to start being a heavy equipment operator. <laughs> heavy drinker, too. I need, to, I need to dig a big hole. Heavy, now. Heavy drinker, too. Oh, it's dirty. That's great. That's great. Anyways, Chris, I want to hear more detail on this. That you literally <laughs> walk us through. Get it out of a walk us through what? In cinematic fashion, as you're narrating, let's say as Morgan Freeman, start to finish... Talent contest. You're singing International Harvester. Go. Nobody interrupt him. Yeah, well, uh, you know, there was a time when I thought I sounded okay. All right. And then I heard myself on a recording. As a singer? Now that I'm on this, I probably will not watch this episode. <laughs> <laughs> we can watch the first 45 minutes. Uh, but, yeah, that's true. Yeah. But, uh, you know, I thought it'd be okay. I thought it'd be fun. Try it out once. And, uh, you know, it, it wasn't all that bad, but. Everyone else was way better, and I'm not doing it again. Uh, <laughs> well, that sucks because here's Why? International Harvester. No, okay. <laughs> oh, Pull I'm, it up on the screen. Here's International <laughs> Harvester by Christopher Plaschek. You do not have a video of that. Uh, uh, I don't think we do. I think somebody does, but uh, that'd be a. I it was probably know. on DVD. I just, I, I just want to say this now. Um, Chris really isn't this much shorter than Tyler. He's just sitting in a really small chair. Well, <laughs> You see, you see the height difference. Yeah, yeah. Now? yeah. That's he actually is, his big brother. Like, <laughs> I mean, he is like four four inches shorter than me. What are you doing here? Sorry, my phone's gone. No, I'm. It's ringing. Bridges. It's ringing. I I ignored the call. Don't worry. Chris, are you really four inches shorter than Tyler? About there, yeah. No way. How I'm wide? Down though, it's four inches. Yeah. What's what's the down. girth? How much wide? <laughs> <laughs> oh, loaded, loaded. This is Chris. No, no. We don't want that. Why don't quality. you just play it on mine? <laughs> Too late. Have well, Jake, hey, we're gonna get Jake, Jake plug it in. Do that. Can't plug it in. We don't oh, have a video of it. Leave it. Can you hand me that Mad Dog, please? Uh, after you take a poll, though. Here, Mad Dog. I uh, can't do it, Captain. Okay. Here you go, then. <laughs> There's moonshine. Um, it's vodka lemonade. Oh, yes, please oh. buckle up. Here, we're coming into a little bit of turbulence. Your <laughs> seatbelt sign has come on for your safety. All right. I yeah, got hey, please Chris, keep in you, mind the nearest like exit captain? may be behind For you, you guys yeah, that don't yeah. know, Chris is a pilot. Yes, That's how he, he makes is. me look like shit. <laughs> Chris. <laughs> okay, so here's the thing. How, how, can become, you, how can you be high right now and admit you're a pilot? <laughs> <laughs> That's not true. Here's the thing. I become a dirt foreman at 24 years old, and this fucker runs the flight program. At <laughs> makes me look like shit. You both, maybe went you both like that. go in cockpits or whatever. Oh, we do go in cockpits. <laughs> anyway, anyway Chris, hey, Chris, have you have you ever had to speak over the loudspeaker and tell tell your uh, passengers or anything like that? Run something like that or well, the jet? But I'm sure yeah. you've had passengers before. Yeah, yeah. I play around with it every once in a while. Sure, the, the PA, you know. And <laughs> give, give what if, what if get, you just flick it on as attention, all passengers? Oh, <laughs> that is all. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Chris, give us a little go around. Well, you know, this is a, a critically important lesson. Just get really you know, in there. Okay. Like yeah. really uh, right uh, right we, need to, we need the switch flick or whatever you do, button push, to turn on. Reenact this. Oh, okay. All right. So we got the, the button on the yoke, right? All right. So you key it up. 
Yeah, on an egg. Uh, this all good. You crack an, a fresh egg in the cockpit. <laughs> push the yolk. In. <laughs> <laughs> That's like Joe Tucker did it. What's that? Uh, <laughs> cracked a fresh egg in the cockpit. <laughs> shit, shit, yeah, dude. Jesus. Crack two of them. Holy <laughs> shit. That was so. Wow! <laughs> I, what a roller coaster! I'm going on the record right now. I hate this episode. <laughs> I'm even glad I hung in there. I was like, "What's he getting at?" <laughs> Sorry, can, can we let Chris talk for the thousandth time now? <laughs> you flick the yolk or whatever. Let's <laughs> before Chris starts again. Yeah, let's just keep up. in mind my grandma watches the episode, dude. Real I'm quick. She bought merch. No more. <laughs> she bought merch. We don't care no more. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Cody. I, I, oh my God. I'll drink half if you drink half. I don't think that's a great idea. I think it's Listen, an awesome. We've idea. been drinking for different amounts of time, and that <laughs> no, wait, is less liability for you up. than it is I for me. Catch up. You, well, then you chug the rest of it. How bad is it? Not bad oh. at all. It's easy. Chris, oh, continue your story bad. while Tyler chugs this. Are we gonna do this? It's not really a story. Yeah, it's not a story. It's a it's a demonstration. Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah. Continue your demonstration. This was made two years ago. No, it wasn't the the freaking salsa that it was in. It says lemon. <laughs> oh, well, it was yeah, all lemon salsa. salsa no, dude. lemon, <laughs> lemon <laughs> yeah. moonshine, you bastard. <laughs> oh my! Maybe God. it was two years ago. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Who cares? I'll Chris, continue. Salsa to lemons. When life gives you salsa, you, you make, make beef stew. Salt, you make lemon. You make salsa. beef stew, you idiot. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, and you put cream cheese. Talk in to your us rocket. like we're your exactly. passengers. Go. What do you want a briefing on? Yes, Daddy. Turbulence. <laughs> Turbulence and no sex in the bathrooms. <laughs> uh, engine, <laughs> engine failure. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Is that considered a rectile dysfunction? Maybe. <laughs> engine failure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're waiting. Uh, we're gonna try. Here we go. Everyone, uh, turn us attention. down. Turn us down. Turn us down. We just want to hear Chris. Go, uh, ladies and gentlemen. We seem to be experiencing some engine troubles. It might be a little bit of a bumpy ride. We'll be on the ground shortly. Thank you. That's actually <laughs> that was not bad. Except I don't want to be there um, shortly. That sounds like we're gonna crash. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> the man across from me has a handgun. <laughs> <laughs> also, can I get some more peanuts, please? Uh, so I I went in a plane with Chris once, and he admitted it after we <laughs> after we landed that it was this. the scariest he's ever was, had for taking off. And Tucker's in the plane I was with, well. yes. yes. Because yes, yes, yes. I'm fat as shit. Chris, <laughs> tell us that story. All right, I think I'm uh, actually going to slam this. Yeah. Do it. How fun? Yeah. How oh. Oh. It Thought it'd be fun. Yeah, to go and uh, go and take a ride with them around. Uh, that was actually about this time, a really long time ago. It was Man, super was hot. One of our oh my god, it was so hot up there. Very hot. So hotter it is, uh, higher density altitude. So the engine doesn't perform quite as well. Okay. Airplanes don't fly as well. Right. Um, yeah, it took off out a out a, a local airport here that kind of had some trees around it, and uh, you know we we made it, but it was a little closer than I expected it to be. All right. You know, probably cleared them by about 100 feet. So. <laughs> that seems close. That but seems, that is, I don't like that. And so, like, w while we're up there, I'm like, God, this is pretty close. So I'm just not going to say anything. You know, Chris is a pilot. By the He's trees? The, yes. Yeah, okay. yeah. He's the expert and whatnot. That's the thing. He maintained composure amazing. Like, he did not freak out. Like, if he said anything, me and Tucker would have lost our shit. Like, he was like, uh, he's thinking his head, oh, we're fucked. We're fucked. We're going to die probably, right now. He probably knew that, though. <laughs> I didn't know. No, he knew that. Oh, he knew. But he, he knew wasn't that. He knew that if keep us calm. Yes, but he, he knew, knew that if he freaked out, oh, you'd we, freak out, and then he'd freak out again. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And it, it was great because, like, what? It was right after the trees, or once we were up. He's like, "I'm not gonna lie to you guys. That was the scariest takeoff I've ever done." <laughs> 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 like, what? Wait, what? I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I'm gonna sleep very well after that. That <laughs> was moonshine. Yeah, and it was really strong. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Good night, handsome. <laughs> Good night. Polish off the whole thing. He did do that. It was like half full. Yikes. It was half brother's empty. Well, it was half empty. You're right. Mm -hmm. Tyler, give your best um, impression of a pilot that has to inform the passengers that they're going down without freaking them out. You're hitting the button, talking over the intercom. All right, go. you got to mute us. Go. What do you address them as? Ladies and gentlemen. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. We are landing at Minneapolis Airport in 
right now. <laughs> wow. Okay, it was a good Literally, voice. Literally, and then. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Here, here's mine. Here's mine. Ladies and gentlemen, the landing gear just went out. Please do not panic. The seatbelt sign is on for your safety. If you could please locate the exits behind you or in front of you, uh, please keep in mind if you are not willing to assist others that uh, you need to switch seats with someone else. Also, if you are not willing to jump out of the plane, hang on. You probably die on the landing strip. <laughs> that was pretty good. Yeah, that was great. All right, and we've arrived at our destination. Looks like 20 minutes early. It is 70 <laughs> degrees Fahrenheit here. It is and 130 degrees in hell. Yeah. 11, <laughs> 11 o'clock local time. I might time. be able to survive. <laughs> 11 um, o'clock local time, and uh, if you look off to your left, you'll actually catch a beautiful Miami sunset. Wow. Wow. Miami wow. is in hell. That's it. I watched it. <laughs> great. Is that the clap? I loved it. No, that's... I would suggest <laughs> not talking about dying. Why? You're supposed you don't to know anything. <laughs> you don't know anything about piloting stuff, dude. I talked to paramedics this week, and they straight up told the guy, you you have a very good chance of dying if you don't go to the hospital. So they're pretty straight up with it. Why can't you just be? <laughs> yeah, right. Like, you just tell it how it is. Who cares if they panic? Yeah, just just run it, you know? <laughs> Say, Statistically hey, you, speaking, you're everyone. You're bad. You're toast, dude. <laughs> just hit him with it right away. You, can't you lock yourself in the cockpit? Who cares? Right away, yeah. just tell them, ladies and gentlemen, you know, uh, statistically speaking, we're going to make it to our destination. But yeah. if we don't, I will let you know, and it, it's going to be bad. So just Yeah, what are they going to do? On. Take away your birthday? Well, they still might make it to their <laughs> yeah. destination, just not alive. Right. Yeah. yeah. I mean, <laughs> get them there. Hey, Chris. For that's the, the deal. Wanted, dead or alive, dude. Get them there. <laughs> it wasn't. They didn't read the ticket. That's have you ever thought about song. bringing a parachute just in case the plane would go down? Do they have them? We need How inside street knowledge. Be if you got on a small plane, all your passengers get in, and the pilot's wearing a parachute <laughs> <laughs> and goggles and yeah, goggles. Right. Y'all ready, dude? You're you're greeting your passengers, and you're we're gonna have screaming. a great jump today. Yeah, it's yeah, gonna be the best thing, Chris. <laughs> Big suggestion. You need to memorize that little turtle from Finding Nemo. All right, everybody, we're going to have a great jump today. <laughs> Dude. Do you have your exit, buddy? <laughs> all right, we're going to cut all this because this is our next viral video because that is fucking gold. If we can just have him meet us at the airport and just redo this to us, have him be the parachute goggles, <laughs> and we're just like in tuxes ready to go to a business meeting. <laughs> All right, that's it. We're cutting all this. Fuck it. All right, now we need an extra. Oh, shit, we're at an hour. Okay, later. Fuck this stuff. <laughs> Fuck later. We're actually not at an hour because there's a lot of okay, I gotta know, free the time week, in there. Okay. Uh, just kidding. What's going on? Lord of Man of the Week. If you don't like that, you do it. You know, I just no, really no, no, I'm something. saying it's natural. What's your Florida man of the week? Go ahead. I thought every time you do that intro, you actually say that. He does. I did once. <laughs> well, well, well one time twice. just because Chris is here. Are you ready? Okay. This is all in tandem. I'll keep your mic on. <laughs> Florida man of the week. Yeah, close enough, right? Yeah, that's that good. I don't, I don't have my headphones on, so I couldn't really hear it. it kinda... It's not really an acoustic environment. Yeah, you know, like uh, <laughs> I've been like, if the these walls were like the thing padded. is, the thing is, I have a bank account, I have a savings account, and a checking account, and like I have to transfer from the savings to the checking, and it takes like two to three days. So like, it just kind of fucks up my singing. <laughs> <laughs> sure, what I get you, dude. What's the all right? Who's the Florida man? Tyler Dearden. Why does that name sound so familiar? <laughs> no. No. Well, his name's gay as shit. I was going to say that. Tyler. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. Why do you got to use the G word again? Are you? Why are you so like why anti? So, oh, like, there we go. go. If you use it, it loses the power. Right? I don't know. No, that's not how that works at all. Whatever. It gains power. It's evil, dude. No, it's, it puts the lotion on the skin or else it gets the hose again, I think is what you're looking I'm for. I'm trying to get the hose again, bro. Let's go. Put uh, the lotion on the skin. Yeah. Let's go back to 2017. <laughs> I think they got hoses at the cricket. Oh. <laughs> anyway, Florida Her man, dad. Tyler Durden, okay. go. Yeah, what's it? Okay. Our Florida man of the week this week is Tyler Dearden. He is a man, and he is in Florida, and he is also 22 years old. So, Mr. Dearden was out playing golf, just like our fucking shitty-ass producer that gets all his money from his dad was <laughs> earlier today. 
But he wasn't really playing golf. He was on the um the putting, the, That's uh, so funny. <laughs> <laughs> Driving range. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> oh, okay. This is off the rails. This guy's a dick. But I'm so glad you brought this range. one. Okay. Well, I was trying to transition what you're doing earlier, but it's just whatever. So Tyler Dearden was on the driving range, and he was stealing, he was stealing golf balls out of this elderly man's freaking golf pail next to him. You know how you at the at the golf course you get the pail, of, yeah. the bucket of balls. Yeah. So he was stealing balls and shooting them. Well, the guy said, "Hey, you can't do that. You can't do that." Well, he the fucking snitch. Old ass fucker, dude. You want to talk about? You want to talk about millennials, dude? What? Gen Zs are snitches, bro. Gen Zs, the baby boomers. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gen they, Z is the one after us, buddy. Okay, the boomers are snitches, dude. Okay, so Gen the X boomer is the one before us. Yeah, and then there's Gen B, something else, C, and then D. Boomer. Anyway, double D. Uh so this freaking boomer went and tattletailed on him. Mm-hmm. He comes back out. Well, my boy Tyler, he comes back and he's like, you know, I want to apologize. I want to apologize. Goes up to apologize, freaking decks him in the face. Just lays this old, this freaking boomer out, put him back to Boomtown, you know? <laughs> Woo! Straight out of Dogtown, you know what I mean? And uh, <laughs> I know laid him exactly out. exactly what you mean. Laid him out, freaking apparently broke this guy's rib and cut him that he needed stitches. I don't know if he's laying into him or whatnot. Oh, must have had one of them Hancock sucker punches. <laughs> oh! One of those around you. You paid for him. How much? Stop. <laughs> Stop. No. So uh, yeah, laid this guy out, broke his ribs, gave him some stitches. That's why you let people steal your balls. Okay. I let everybody grab my balls if they want to. I actually can vouch to that. I saw his yeah. testiculars last weekend. Yeah, I put him in the the testicles. Did you? And he yeah. Or, yeah. Did, hey, did or you? Or call him your nylons? You, we saw your nylons. <laughs> yes, we did actually see my nylons. Have you guys ever f- fallen off a ball washer? Well, no. You're not skilled enough. That's what that was literally the test jacuzzi before a test jacuzzi, bro. Right. Putting ball washers where it's a at. Ball put your in a ball washer. Put your balls in ball washer. Yeah. Ball washer, yeah. At the golf course. That's the joke. Off. You ever fallen off of it? You got to get up there and put your balls in it. <laughs> That's what's actually cool because the golf carts at, at <laughs> Rust City here? they got ball washers built in, so it was like <laughs> kind of like a drive-through. They are kind of hip height too. It was sick, bro. It was sick. Whatever, dude. Exactly. Heard that. What did, I want to get his take on this because everybody else that comes in here is like, yes, freaking suck in person. We're pretty tuned. Oh, I'm tuned up. Yeah, you, you, I could, your eyes are getting droopier. We're going. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's up, dude? What's going on with you right now? I can hear flavors. You sound insane. I can't hear shit. What's Chris's take mouth? on this? Chris, what's it like being on with the boys? Is it what you imagine? Is it what you see on YouTube? Yes or no? Yeah. Yeah, except this place is way smaller than it looks on Yeah, mm-hmm. I do them angles. That's what all the girls say, too. It's called Cinema <laughs> Magic. Mm-hmm. Also, Jake. Yeah, oh, Jake. And yeah, it's also named Jake. It's called Jake. Jake is really good at making small things look big. Ask Tyler's OnlyFans. You can follow it for nine ninety nine. Anybody in Rust City. Yeah, but you guys are definitely <laughs> just as funny. Just as funny in person as yeah. you are uh, on YouTube. Well, wow, thanks, Chris. That's it means nice, a lot. Everybody else Gangster. Says we suck uh, we're kind of running close on time. Chris, will you maybe give us a pilot's outro before we hit the uh, outro for the podcast? Do you have a cool ass song? How, we how would we be landing into... Like that? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> was landing? I thought you were going to fall. I, landing into the studio. Here we are. Studios MSP announce it over the intercom. Okay, we're landing in the studio. Yep. All right. Well, mm. this would be a very hard landing to, to stop in this distance. It's long enough. So. No, bullshit. It's about a quarter <laughs> mile. So it would be pretty bumpy. Crank right? us down. Okay. Hit it. All right. Well, sorry about the hard landing, folks. We are taxiing into the uh, terminal here. You will find your baggage at gate uh, G3. I don't even know if that exists, but thanks for flying with us, and we'll see you next time. Thanks for listening to On Tap with the Boys. Be sure to follow us on social media and stay updated. Tune in next week for another episode about Tyler's problems. Any final words, Tyler? I should have.